Hi, I'm Eric Reynolds, Customer Service Manager at Steve's Pest Control. Our topic this month is bed bugs. In the next few moments, we're going to be telling you a little bit about bed bugs, and also we'll take a look at a typical hotel room and show you some things that we look for while doing an inspection. Detecting bed bugs can be very difficult, especially when their population is low. You can start by looking for bed bugs themselves in mattress seams, box springs, and headboards. Look for dark spotting or staining, as well as eggshells and brown molted skins. Blood spotting on bed sheets is another clear sign. Since bed bugs feed on exposed skin, look for welts that have appeared overnight on your arms, legs, back, neck, or face. Adult bed bugs are not microscopic. They're about a quarter of an inch long, about the size of an apple seed, reddish brown in color, and have an oval flattened body. They feed on the blood of humans and animals. Bed bugs are active mainly at night while people are asleep. They will engorge themselves with blood for about three to 10 minutes. They actually inject a saliva secretion, which acts as a anesthetic and blood thinner, so you don't feel them bite. Bed bugs are efficient hitchhikers and are usually transported in on luggage, furniture, beds, clothing, and from people. Once brought in, they can spread throughout a building. Bed bugs have been found in homes, apartments, hotels, healthcare facilities, dormitories, schools, cruise ships, and modes of transportation such as taxis, planes, buses, and even trains. Once they finish feeding, they immediately crawl off to hide, reproduce, and molt. They prefer to hide close to where people sleep like seams in a mattress, in the box springs, bed framing, and around headboards. But they can also hide in wall voids, electrical outlets, dressers and nightstands, behind baseboards, behind picture frames, or any similar crack and crevice area. Another key area to check is the backing on your box springs. Any, like I said before, any crack and crevice area is a good area to look. As you can see, Tim's pulling up all the areas around the backing and looking for any evidence of bed bugs or markings from them, as we talked about earlier with the blood spots. Another key area on the box spring is around the tag. This provides another crack and crevice area where bed bugs may hide. It oftentimes takes the combination of heat and chemical treatments to eradicate the infestation. It also requires an experienced and skilled technician to perform this treatment. The professionals at Steve's Pest Control have the experience and the tools to take care of this problem. If you think you may have a problem with bed bugs, don't hesitate to contact us at Steve's Pest Control. We have the experience and the tools to take care of your problem. Now you got a friend in the pest control business, Steve's Pest Control.